Hey everyone, I'm at the hotel in Oklahoma City and last night I rinsed my hair with water. So I just wanted to show you this morning kind of what it looks like after a little over a month just rinsing with water. My faithful vlog follower and friend Stuart has already watched all my videos <laughs> to this point and has given me a list of recommendations for things to see here in Oklahoma City. He is a traveler extraordinaire. Hi Stuart! Thanks for watching! I'm here at the Oklahoma City National Memorial and Museum. I'm gonna go down there shortly. Commemorates the victims of the 1995 bombing. 168 people died in the bombing, and they're represented here by these empty chairs. We got the survivors of the bombing in the Alfred P. Murrah building and the surrounding buildings here. The names of the victims who died are on each of the chairs. One name per chair. It's a really interesting video explaining the memorial and the 901 gate represents before the bombing happened, which happened at 902. And so you have the, the effects of the bombing at 902 and then the 903 gate when everything had changed for the future. From 901 definitely visit it if you are in the area. It's really, really powerful. Thanks, Stuart, for affirming that this memorial was something that should be seen just had a lovely quick stop at the Oklahoma City Museum of Art, thanks again Stuart, and stopped and saw the Dale Julie exhibit and I got some of the photos to show you now. It's a really interesting sculptor and exhibition up there. I also stopped into the Auburn Kinetic Art Exhibition, visual art from the 60s. So it was just a quick stop. Uh, I'm gonna go get some dinner now because I, well, I was entering the museum, I realized that they do films there. So tonight at eight, they're showing a series of Oscar nominated short films. So I'm gonna go back at eight and watch some films. Okay, I am walking to Bricktown Brewery for an early dinner, because I think I accidentally skipped lunch, which was really unlike me. <laughs> but in my quest to get my tent fixed, I think I was focused. Brecktown Brewery knows about the hedge. You know I gotta go for that. <laughs> I also got a beer flight. The stout was my favorite, but it was a really solid mix. Oklahoma City has this cool little like canal district in Bricktown. It's really cool. You guys, this is such a fun canal <laughs> area. Bars and restaurants and wine tastings and painting and wine and trampolines and all this stuff. It's super fun. I'm off to the candy factory. And then to my very fine film watching. A lovely day and evening in Oklahoma City. It was a really nice series of five short films that I saw that were Oscar nominated. And it was my first time in a theater in over a year. They had rows blocked off 
and seats blocked off so it was pretty distance and there weren't that many people there to begin with so tomorrow I head to Chickasaw National Recreation Area which is somewhere between like an hour hour and a half from here and we'll test out those tent poles.